is Addie D. Hilster, and I am here today at Spiral Path Yoga Center, and we're going to be practicing a gratitude meditation. So make sure that you're sitting in a way that feels comfortable enough for now for these next few minutes when we're doing this practice together, and you could be sitting on the floor like I am, or maybe grab a chair if that works better for your body. So let's set ourselves up and come into our posture for the practice. And I'll ring this bell for us to begin and I'll offer you some guidance for practicing a gratitude meditation. Welcome to sit with your eyes closed, or if they're open, just let the eyes be soft, relaxed eyes. Beginning to feel down to the foundation of your sitting posture, noticing where you're in contact with the floor, your cushion, the chair. Maybe that's in the feet, the legs, or the sitting bones, where you can feel that contact. Tuning into that feeling of support. Imagine that you're taking in that feeling of stability, borrowing a little stability from the floor, the earth, the ground, the chair. Appreciating that you're supported here, you're held here in this meditation. And then opening to the feeling of the body, the outline and form of this body sitting here. Noticing the play of sensations throughout the body, more obvious in some places than others. But you can sense the body's aliveness. And maybe there's a mix of sensations where some are pleasant, some might be uncomfortable, and many are just kind of okay and neutral. And if there is discomfort, maybe there's something in flux in your body, you can acknowledge that. Not ignoring that, but also remembering to open to the goodness of the body and to feel and savor the pleasant sensations, feeling of relaxation, stability. And to appreciate any and all parts of the body that are working well. There are so many ways that the body takes care of itself without us even having to tell it to do that. Appreciating how much is fine, okay functioning in the body. And 
connecting to the feeling of the breath. Feeling that swell as the breath comes into the body and that release as you exhale. It's life-giving energy coming from the outside. connection to your environment through the breath. Taking the next few breaths with a sense of gratitude, appreciation of this simple but absolutely essential process, this breath of life. Feeling into the activity level of your mind right now. Noticing if it's busy or calm, clear or confused. We know we go through so many mind states. Can we appreciate the mind for its imagination, creativity. Acknowledging your own intelligence and wisdom, its qualities of mind. and appreciating that the mind is malleable. We can actually influence it, we can do practices that help incline the mind in a good direction. Practicing gratitude. to mind someone that you feel grateful to. Maybe you just feel a sense of appreciation for them. Someone that has supported your life in some way. Maybe they took care of you at a time when you needed help. Or maybe just someone who brought you a cup of coffee today large or small, this act of kindness can be a vehicle for your gratitude. As you bring this person to mind, maybe you start to notice a sense of warmth, an emotion of appreciation or caring. Maybe there's sensations in the body that go along with that. Maybe it's words of gratitude. Internally saying thank you. And then consider someone who supported your life, but you actually don't even know this person. A stranger who has done something that contributed to your life. Maybe the person who made your clothes, someone who sweeps the streets.
someone who stopped at a red light so that you could move through. Noticing what you feel or what words or images come to mind as you appreciate the actions of another. In whatever way works for you, leaning in to that feeling of gratitude. Call to mind a fortunate circumstance, something that occurred in your life recently or in the past, anything, something that worked out well, maybe a stroke of luck. Letting yourself be filled with the appreciation for this fortunate circumstance. Or the conditions you have in your life that are supportive. And maybe many come to mind. Let them in. Perhaps you feel a sense of a smile. And allow that to be another expression of your gratitude. And let's open to a sense of gratitude for this planet itself, our home. Knowing that everything we are Everything we have comes from this earth. We're made of the same elements as the earth itself. The earth provides everything that we need. Appreciating the beauty of this planet, its abundance, the trees, the fields, the oceans, the rivers, the sky. Noticing what you feel as you recall this environment, your home sense of warmth or connection. Maybe images come to mind or words of thank you. Maybe a smile. And then come back to your own breath. Feeling your body pulsing with life. This breath that's yours, but also interconnected with everything else, not really separate from this environment. with any sense of connection, gratitude, joy, or abundance, or simply a little smile that you feel a 
arising in this moment. As we come towards the end of this practice, I'll finish with a quote by Gilbert Chesterton. He said, I would maintain that thanks are the highest form of thought and that gratitude is happiness doubled by wonder. Gratitude is happiness doubled by wonder. Thank you very much for your presence and your practice.